Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Emmo, and today it is a wacky Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> and boy, do we have the guitar to prove it. Uh, lots of crazy stuff going on here at Norm's. He's obviously brought back 58 to 60 guitars. So we're just trying to inventory these guitars, set up these guitars. Joel and John are doing a great job. Um, it's a lot of work, but we need these guitars. What else are we going to do without them? <laughs> um, also, uh, my show's coming up on 11-16, November 16th. I'm playing the whiskey. I'm getting all this stuff ready for you guys. And I'm nervous. <laughs> I say it every day, but it's going to get better. We're going to do this together. Um, other than that, make sure you check out our guitar giveaway. Uh, there's a video. It should be the one right before this with Brandon, um, our newest guy. Well, he's actually been here for a bit, but he's proven himself. <laughs> and uh, he did a great video uh, going over the guitar. Um, so get on it. We'd love to. We'd love for you guys to win something. So, And uh, we're going to try to do something on Guitar of the Day, too. Jen and I are talking. Don't worry figure it out other than that let's get wacky so Whoa. This, exactly start with the bullseye that'll kind of give some stuff away there's some really cool stuff on here you can already tell um you got your backstage pass to the ozzy osbourne world tour 2007-2008 this is november 30th 2007 i don't know yeah so okay Wow, all right, so this guy, band guest, clearly we got something special. And then we got a signature here, and it says 2208. Ozzy, Black Label Society, I don't know. <laughs> I think that's Dime Bag, Dime, it says, so maybe Dime Bag. I know they were good friends, um, but let's check it out. So what could it be? This. I don't really have a year, because it's kind of a prototype in a way, but it's a Gibson SGV custom shop signature artist proof wow look at that wow oh my gosh so imagine gibson's like we got an idea <laughs> we think this is you <laughs> wow. pretty wild so obviously the sgv here's the sg it goes right into a v pretty wild it's almost as wild as they go. <laughs> and you got uh, the classic Zach Wild EMG pickups. Um, this is kind of a signature of that, of his sound and uh, something different. Um, you get that extra gain while playing these. Um, and then it's pretty interesting. So you got two volume knobs and a tone knob. And then your toggle switch is up here. Um, so when you're on the rhythm, uh, or neck pickup, I should say, uh, this is your volume. And then this is your bridge pickup volume and then there's your tone um you got the little chip uh around the input jack um you got an ebony board like a les paul custom you got the les paul custom inlay on the headstock and block inlays um black tuning pegs let's take a look at the back it's signed by him um and then he wrote all the acts that he's been playing with so it looks also as it's, it's hard to find information on this guitar, but it's a three-piece neck it's looking like, and then you got binding all the way down the bottom. So this is Artist Proof 10. So there was 10 of these made, and this is number 10. Uh, you got Grover tuners. Um, yeah, I mean, if you're a Zach Wild fan... This is your guitar. This is your guitar, man. <laughs> and I think that's cool. You know, I think, uh, I, I mean, obviously everybody knows I love Eddie Van Halen, and he was one of the first to kind of start these designs on guitars, you know, whether it's stripes or polka dots or circles, and I love when uh, these got the lineage of this kind of guitar playing. Um, and Zach did a great job. I mean, he followed Randy Rose and Jake E. Lee. Um, we're also going to do Bark at the Moon today. That was not Zach Wild, but he's played it a lot, and just a cool song. A lot of people forget how great Jake E. Lee was, too. But um, Zach Wild's no exception. So we're going to take this guitar out and see if we can tame the beast. Let's do it. Let's go. It's crunch time. <laughs> All right, we're out front with the Gibson SG Flying V. Zach Wild, artist proof. Signed by Zach. You got two MG, EMG pickups. We're going through the 1966 Fender Pro Reverb. I'll accuse the noon a little bit of overdrive. Here we go.
little bear. Big bear today. <laughs> All right, here we go in the middle position. You like Zach Wild? Me too. Here we go. Little miracle man for a little bear. <laughs> Up. One more time. Up. Both pickups together. Here we go. Pickup. He's half wolf. <laughs> it really works for this segment. This wasn't Zach Wild, but he's covered it many times. This is Jakey Lee. This is Bark at the Moon. Feel free to bark if you want. <laughs> could sleep through Zach Wild. <laughs> he did it. Thank you, little bear, for being here. Well, catch all these guitars at normansrareguitars.com and also on Instagram and Facebook. It was definitely a wacky Wednesday today. <laughs> We're going to keep going with it. See you guys tomorrow for a thumping Thursday. Maybe some edibles. Woo! That's my boy, Todd. <laughs> See you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hey, little bear. Bullseye.